probably my final review for college, considering I'm leaving tomorrow. I'll also have hopefully scheduled out some Warcraft hoping to fill up the channel to around Christmas. Anyways, this is a game I just received a key for and couldn't resist accepting. Uh, Nietzsche, next survival game. This is um, an early access game, actually, I believe. Uh, that's a little bit. Uh, okay, let's actually find this in here. Let's go to the store page, take a look at it, make sure we get some information on it. See if it's out now on Steam. Ah, it's out now. Early access, nineteen dollars. You can see right there. Uh, developer Team Niche, so studios made for this game. So this is probably their first one. Uh, part of the goal of this game is to uh, kind of help teach uh, genetics and how they work through the gameplay. You have like uh, dominant and recessive genes and all sorts of stuff. And you. Uh, control these little creatures here. I'll start. Uh, I'll start a game right now, as you can kind of see. And you start with a pair. And you just kind of survive for as long as possible. I played for about eh, 30, 40 minutes last night when I got the key is to try it out, get a feel for the game. So, um, it was okay. It was fun. It well, it wasn't not fun. I enjoyed the time. I played for 40 minutes, obviously. I should probably be sleeping. Start out here, you always have your nest, your first, your yeah, Adam and Eve, that's kind of a nice little thing there. Yeah, and a berry bush, you can just start, and start with 20 food. You can go here, look at her. She has all her genes, this I believe. Yeah, this is always the same, so she'll have poison things. She'll have a uh, big nose, all these stuff you'll find. Occasionally find uh, other members of your uh, species out and about, and they'll join your team. And you start breeding. You'll, I believe that. Uh, oh, yeah. So start by creating your first kid. There are several different biomes. We have this um, kind of savannah biome with like cacti that hurt you when you try to eat them. Although I would imagine that. One of the traits of that you can get or find you know, maybe make some not take the energy try to get out of them. Ah, this looks like a little marsh. Yeah, I haven't actually seen this biome before. You have this grasslands and there's one more alpine leaf. Well you have a limited num yeah, you have I believe right there you can see she has two more actions you can take uh on this day and he has no more. You can move around that uh, takes an action, you can look around in the bushes, do other stuff. Tastings menu, I haven't really actually looked into a whole lot. I just don't really have a tutorial unless I missed it in right now. Oh, uh, that's nice, so for more of these mutations, I have to do so. 20 savannah fields explored, or 15 desert fields explored, so there's more than 3 rounds, I take it. Collect berries, get different combinations of fur. Um, yeah, some random mutations. Um, oh, drag and drop your genes here to mutate your offspring. Ah, uh -huh, so I can um, give it a 30% chance. Ah! So I can increase the likelihood of something popping up. Dots no effect yet. Let's see here. What do I want? Hearing strength. Speed, eyesight, smelling, hearing, better suited for cold, some strength, better suited for just being in the heat, ah, and some speed, speed versus strength, um, hmm, smelling, no effect yet. Uh, to the string. You know what? Sure. I'm starting to get antlers. That and. Uh, I suspect those would be exclusive. And maybe dots, because I think they look nice. A new gene might be unlocked. Huh. Oh! Oh, let's read this. Welcome, pack members. Oh, I should have seen this a while ago. 
Place those next to each other. Click the heart. Yeah. Start getting a baby. Have a look at the GUI. Now it's easier than it seems. Daily energy. Yep. End the day. Mutations menu. You just looked at food. We share food as a family. Whenever one member performs a task, it needs food. So yeah, every action requires a little bit of food. Age. You can see just born, a little bit older, and so on. Kind of like the Sims. You might remember. Okay. Well, this is an ability. Ah, so that's abilities. That makes sense. Born to interact with the world. Inherit genes. So those are inherited by the ancestors. Now, affect the abilities. Sickness is more likely to be acquired in swamp biomes. I did not know that. Mm hmm. Chance of sickness. Okay. Yeah, it makes sense. Your immunities. You mix, and if you have the same immunity, if I were to show you the tool tap, it increases the chance of getting sick. You can jump to any field that shows a paw location, not just the ones around you. Oh, so if I were to click a paw off somewhere else, that's one action. Good to know. Press the tab to switch between animals. I did not know that. I just do it by clicking on them. Press space on today. That's a nice quick shortcut. Okay. So yeah, like I said, you can see having the same toys increases the risk of being sick. So let's see here. She's out of action. She has out of action. So let's end the day. The first time... Yeah, the baby popped out the first day. Uh-huh. And you can see that was uh, moving. That means there's an animal out there. Ah. Uh, so I think, yep, yeah, that's another little animal that's going to join our pack. Well, she can get some food. He can go over here. Let's use Waz. Uh, let's move out here then. Do do up a little. Um, almost the next stage. So yeah, they can't as one person. I think Wait, I can do dab him. Uh, that's yep. They can't as one. So that's our new guy or girl, I guess. And have her go and search for food. That's a swamp down there. Which I did not know that swamps were a thing. Ah, food. That's useful. I'll leave him there to get the food next turn. He's out. Oh. So as he get older, they gain more actions, I assume. And come up here. And turn. Up here, I want some food from this. Keep gathering that. What are you talking to? Uh, recording. Once it's the last day before we leave. Okay. Uh, would you talk, ask your roommate if you need a printer? Uh huh. Or you just if I want one? Because I can imagine you uh, turn everything in by a. Mm-hmm. I will. And the day. Oh yeah, as you can see here, that's how much food the bush has. It regens by one per day. So finish up there. Uh get one there. Come up here. I don't actually know what that is. And there's something out there. You why don't you come back here and can't exactly gather food until you're older. Yeah, it's kind of weird the gathering food part. I'm not entirely sure about that. Ah, I should probably have the abilities. So what is this? Plus two. So I think that's how many actions it takes. Oh, so yeah. Oh, so it does have the ability to collect, I would assume. Hmm. Oh well. Let's move you 
And it's one of those things. They hurt you, but you get uh, some food. What are those? I don't want to exactly do that. And start hunting rabbits. Oh, this works kind of like Dungeons of Dreadmore in regard to the other animals. Every time you take an action, everything takes an action. So, uh, when I do that, see the bunny moved. At this point, I might as well migrate back there. Oh, hey, we have a new one. And you can take the food. Uh huh. Okay. You want to move up there. You want to get there. Ah, uh, that's annoying. I'm not gonna try to get food again. Oh, hungry. So yeah, the problem with that is that it makes it hard, a lot harder for you to hunt animals. So you really just what I've been doing is winding up camping by berry bushes. So I'm fairly certain is not like what you should be doing. Well, let's just, uh, never actually, oh. Well, you can do that, get some food there. Atriot gets us a reasonably large amount. I want to try to get to the water and see if there's anything I can do there. Try to position her next to the bushes to see if we can get any food from it. Oh, let's end the turn. Yep. Can't attack it. Oh. Huh. I wonder what you can do here. You can look at it. Not that still hurts you. I'm not gonna keep doing that. There is nothing really that we can do at oh ah. So now we can come down here. I don't think we can get over to there. Yep. So yes, yeah, is I'm fairly certain one of the earliest builds of this game. So, you can kind of get an idea for the current state of gameplay, and they are, we can go back to the main menu here, you can see the next dock date they plan is in October, so we're trying to get more or less monthly updates, going to be adding presumably a lot to the game. Oh, I should mention, there's one thing that we didn't see in there that I know of, or it's those routes, but there's also a larger animal which you can hunt as well. It will actually fight back. It's kind of like, uh, kind of like that thing, that weird mountain line. So, but yeah, anyway, this is neat at pretty early on. Uh, if you want the game, there will be a link in the description. Anyways, have a nice day, and goodbye.